All right, after opening Microsoft Word, I create a blank document and I want to talk about some shortcut tips in Microsoft Word. Allow me to create a random text, equal rand. As you know, I mentioned in beginner course, you could make equal rand, open parentheses. For example, three paragraph and each one have four sentences. Okay, close it and press enter or return key. There it is. Note that in Microsoft Word, we have several different shortcuts. For example, if I select my text and hover on the bold, as you see, it is written bold. In the parentheses, written control plus B or command plus B on the Mac. Instead of clicking on that, you know, if I hold on the control or command key and press B, it will set bold and again will revert it. And if you want to go font settings, you could click on this icon here, font. As you see, it is written Control or Command D. If I click on that, font settings dialog box will open. Or I could press Control or Command D to open it. But some tools have multiple shortcuts. For example, instead of Control or Command D, I could hold on the shift control or shift command on the Mac and press P and as you see again font dialog box will open. I cancel it. Another thing on the shortcut is they are not always doing the same things and it just depends on some conditions. As I mentioned if I press control or command D the font dialog box will open but if I create a shape, I'm going to insert shape and rectangle. Now, while my shape or any elements like pictures, charts, smart arts or so is selected. Now, if I press Ctrl or Command D again, as you see, the font dialog box it didn't open. Actually, it is duplicated the shape. So note that some shortcuts aren't statics to doing one command. If I select somewhere else, press Ctrl or Command D will open fonts. And if I select shapes or other elements, Ctrl or Command D will duplicate it. One more thing, sometimes you don't see the shortcuts on some commands. Of course, if I could add here or on the ribbon, you might see, but in some cases you might don't see. If I go to file, there is no save as shortcut you could see here. I could add it from quick access toolbar. Click on this arrow, more commands. I will search on all commands. All right, save as, add and OK. Now you could see the shortcut of save as, it is F12. If I press F12, it will open the save as dialog box. If you want to access all shortcuts in Microsoft Office Word, you could of course search on internet or export them, which I will mention in the next video. But before that, let me give you one more tip. I will add number one here and select it. And I want to give you one more additional tips about shortcuts. Here in the font section, you will see superscript and the shortcut it is Control Shift Plus or Command Shift Plus on the Mac. What does it mean? If you check your keyboard, the plus sign or character, it is the secondary and it is not primary. So if I hold on the shift control or shift command and press plus from the calculator sections, which it is in the right side of keyboards, it does nothing happen. And most laptops or some keyboards even don't have this section. So note that it is not about the plus sign on the calculator section. It is the secondary. You know, if I press the equal sign from my keyboard, of course, it will insert equal character. But if I hold on the shift key from my keyboard and now press equal sign, it will insert plus sign or plus character. After selecting my character, you have to hold on the shift control or shift command on the Mac and press equal sign. You see? And if I do that again, it will revert it. So don't confuse. Command Shift Plus, it is not correctly. It is Control Shift. 
or command shift equal which shift equal make a plus sign so instead of that i could write something like the shortcut it is control plus plus actually this is the right shortcut for helping but to not confusing they written something like that or i could write control plus shift plus equal so don't confuse that it is not control shift plus it is shift control and equal sign 